Hey guys, I'm fishing today with my boy David. And, like always, I caught the first fish. Just a little pumpkin seed. You didn't catch the first fish last time, I don't think. Well, that was last time. That's okay. Okay, I caught a fish. There you go, pumpkin seed. Just on my uh, bottom fishing rod. And I'm, bo I'm bobber fishing for anything that bites, and I'm bo bobber fishing for crappy and loafing. Hey, you should show my rod. That's insane. Yeah, David, he left his stuff in his mom's car, so he has to use this. And he put this huge reel on for, like, salt water on this little pole, five feet. Oh, we'll come back and get more fish. Bye-bye, fish. Yep, he's gone. Guys, and we got another fish here. Another pumpkin seed. I just set my pole down. The bell started going off. And I pulled in. This one's way smaller. Whoops. Get in there. And he's gone. Just on, like, crawler in a bottom fishing rig. Next to this wall thing. Okay, this time David's got a fish, guys. Yeah. It's a little bluegill, if I saw it right. Yeah, it is. Let me see him. There you go. Yep, it's a nice yeah. male bluegill. Yeah. Toss him back if you want. Cause yeah, I let him go. Bye, dude. We gotta get some bigger fish to fry. We just found the hugest freaking frog I think I've ever seen in person. Well, I've seen one bigger. Yeah, yeah. That was insanely huge. Anyway, there it is. Alright, you ready? He's gonna use his new hat, but whatever. Oh, yes! Holy! <laughs> We're not eating him, by the way. Oh, no way. Dude, this thing's huge. This thing's huge. Oh. That's my hand. It's putting some of the fish we catch. Yeah. Look at this guy. I don't know what he is. Male? Yeah, male. What? He's flipping. Is he's, it a is it a bullfrog? Yeah, I think I think so. That's huge. I know, he's a male. He's clamped onto my fingers. I wanna know why. <laughs> Doesn't wanna die. That is huge. He's got some weird stuff on his back. Maybe he's been bit at or something. <sighs> Looks think, like teeth marks. Too, yeah. too I think big. We're gonna let him go and keep yeah, fishing. Just, Ooh, he's huge. Okay, guys. Number three for me. That was David. Look what I got here. Nice little rock bass. I haven't caught one in a while, so I'm going to release him now. Here he goes. And he's off. We moved spots. You know, we were right there. Now we're right here. Somewhat of a better area, I think. There's a lot of bluegill. I just got a bite. There's a bite on that rod. So, I'll be back in a second. Hey, guys, and David just caught another fish. Let's see the fish. Whatever. Oh. That is on the nose. Another pumpkin seed. Hey, we got a bullfin? We're gonna release him. Yep, we've had a nice blue I caught a nice blue bill earlier. Uh -huh. Wasn't able to get it on camera though. Okay, got Okay guys, so we move spots back to this spot. Where we cat where we usually fish right by the bridge. First fish I catch. Nice seven inch rock bass. Let's get him back in the water. If he oh, he dodged it off. Perfect. Okay, let's get more fish. Hey guys, bottom fishing again. Same spot. And I just caught another rock bass. This one's a little bigger, a little chunkier, a little longer. Just a little bigger and all. all. Yeah, I might, I'm probably gonna release him. Might eat him. Yeah, it's a nice one. And we're back with another fish. This time it was by David. Little pumpkin seed, maybe orange spotted sunfish, one of the two. And unhook him because he swallowed the hook real deep. We're gonna get him released. Okay guys, haven't caught any more fish, but I'm gonna release this rock bass because I haven't had nothing else to go with it. So let's get one more look at him. Stop flopping. Oh. I'm gonna release him if he stops. Nice seven inch bug on me. Oh. Someone's peanuts. So let's get him off. And the release. He's gone. <laughs>